So today I have some really exciting news. I recently ordered a new magic prop and I'm gonna open it live on camera. And I'm also gonna show you guys a couple new tricks that I've been practicing and they're really cool, so stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I just picked up the box right here. It has my new magic prop. My name is Chris. I'm a magician and I'm making vlogs about my life and about magic here on YouTube. In my apartment, I have one room that's designated. This is the room and I edit videos and I do some other things on these computers and I practice my magic as well, mostly in this room. A lot of my magic props that I have for my shows are in these cupboards over here. I have some suitcases right there. I have a lot of them. Then I have these cupboards right here that are filled with magic related things. I also share this room with my cats. This is Bear right here. And I have one other cat, Maverick. He's not with me right now, but uh, they usually pounce on me whenever I come in here. They're my new cats. I had used to have two other cats, but now I got two new cats. Anyways, take a look at this, guys. This package is my brand new magic prop. Open this live. Hold on. Let me put the camera down. Take your guesses, what do you think is in here? Let me just say, sometimes magicians use the weirdest items. I saw this magician use this item the other day and I thought, man, I gotta get that. What the? Any guesses? Any guesses what this is? Man. What I have here, oh my, that feels oily. This must be an old one then. So let me open this real quick and then I can show you how it's done. Maybe you'll figure it out once you see this here. Hold on, I'll be right back. I need to figure this out. Give me 10 seconds and I'll update you guys. Hang on. 20 minutes later. It took maybe 10 minutes for me to figure this out, but I got it. This is my new magic prop. If you're wondering what it is, it's one of those animal trappers. You'd put it on the ground and an animal would walk up and then step on it and then boom, their foot would be trapped. Now I'm not gonna use this to trap animals, okay? It's just for a prop for my magic show to add some intensity. I wanted to add something new to my shows, especially for shows with teens and adults. I don't personally want to perform the tricks like sawing someone in half or have someone get their hands chopped off, if you know what I'm saying. Like that illusion where someone drops a blade over someone's hands, like that's not my style. I thought I'd go with something more rustic. Let me see if I can show you what this does. Let me get something real quick. Mr. Bear's taking a peek. I see you, Bear. I see you over there. Okay, this is what this does. Ready? If I just press this down, it should activate Whoa! <laughs> I was not expecting that. Dang. Now the lint brush is really hard, so it didn't, you know, nothing happened to the lint brush, but still. This is my new toy. Like I said, I saw a magician use this in one of his shows, and I'm like, dang, that looks interesting. I gotta get it. I'm gonna try and show Kayla a trick with this later. I'm gonna try and surprise her, because Kayla's reactions to my new tricks, when they're good tricks, are the best. Because if she reacts really well to it, then I know it's a good trick. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my new trap toy. I'm gonna be sure to keep that out of the way of the kitties. And by the way, that trick would only be for teen shows and adult shows. That in no way would go into my children's show. I have different sets for different ages. No kids would be seeing that trick, just teens through adults. All right, the next thing I wanted to show you guys was a quick magic trick that I've been practicing. But uh, first, does anybody else have cats that take up their seats? What's she doing to me, Bear? And they like to sit wherever you sit. I have this trick that I perform and it involves four cards and some coins. And I'm actually working on a new revision, a new style of it. And I'll show you guys where I'm at. So this is the original trick. It's very cool. I learned it so long ago, but it is killer. It's awesome. That's the one I've been performing for years. I love it, it is so much fun. And I can do it with pretty much any objects. I did it a while ago in one of my Christmas videos with some candy canes, and it worked super good with candy canes. And that was like two years ago, which is really crazy. But I'm trying to work on a version where I don't need cards, and this is what I've kind of learned over the last couple weeks. All right, here we go, four coins, no cards, one hand filming, one hand doing the magic. And promise me, you will not slow this video down, okay? Promises before we do this? All right, thank you. There you go. That's what I'm working on today. I figured I'd make a little vlog about it. I hope you enjoyed it. I might try to film Kayla's reaction when she gets home. Right now she's working. It's a Saturday. A lot of times we work on the weekends. Most of my weekends are filled up with either shows or 
shows. It's strange to have a Saturday off. I'm enjoying this time. Are you enjoying this? I'd take that as a yes, sir. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little behind the scenes moment of my new magic coming up. If you enjoyed it, be sure to leave it a like and subscribe down below and turn those notifications on. I'll be posting more frequently here on this channel. And if you made it this far into the video, let me know in the comments. Leave a comment down below telling me if you'll be at any Spinners games this year. Now, if you're not from the area, you won't know what the Spinners are. It's a local baseball team. It's actually the single A, I believe affiliate of the Red Sox and they're gonna have me back again for a third year to do some magic on the concourse I'm super pumped I love those games so if you're gonna be at the spinners this year let me know I'll be there and I'll be posting the dates of when I will be there very soon I will keep you guys in the loop but until next time I will see you guys in my next video